Hey guys, John back here with another shoe review and today we are doing a review from YesYeezy.club and to tell you guys the truth, they don't just have Yeezys on the website. I talked to their CEO Jordan and he was able to give me some uh, out of the factory, straight from the factory, was factory prices, wholesale prices uh, of two of my grills. The shattered backboards, uh, 1.0 and the fragments here. So these are the shattered backboards and I got these in this condition with the box all messed up like this but let's do an unboxing and see what it is inside. So what is this? Okay so I think we have a Chinese version of I don't know what this is but I can't read it but apparently it's like some Chinese lettering. Okay. So that's it. Also, let's see the shoes itself. And they do come with a pair of laces of the cream color, the orange, and then the black here. And um, it's funny because they get, gave me something like this whereas usually they come in this kind of um, shoehorn okay so out of the two pairs that I wore I definitely would have to agree that the shattered backboards were more comfortable on my foot than the fragments I was afraid that the stiffness of the leather would affect the flexibility in my foot to walk but that wasn't the case at all and that uh, these were actually made pretty well and uh, no one really noticed whether these were replicas or the real thing. The attention to detail especially in the insoles were very great. Um, it seemed like the real thing everything felt pretty comfortable I'd have to say so definitely a great job to yeseasy.club. Alright, so we're gonna unbox the fragment ones. Ooh, they look good. So here they are. Come with an extra blue laces here. They look clean. So what's funny is, uh, what is this paper here? It doesn't match the regular Jordan paper, so that's questionable. <laughs> but, um,. Yeah, here's the here's our fragments. Pretty clean looking. The fragments on the other hand were definitely very uncomfortable on my foot. My feet are a little bit wider so the pinky toes and the outside of my foot really hurt after walking around these for four hours I would have to say and the leather was a lot more stiffer than I anticipated and it was not as flexible as the shattered backboards. Although the design and attention to detail was pretty good, the back tabs seem a little bit crooked but I'm not sure sure exactly if that's meant to be like that or not because other um, Jordan ones that I've seen also have are not perfect they're not standing up straight up and down so um, but other than that I think the shoe was made pretty well All right, guys. so we have three boxes here and the middle box is the bread box uh, I have my breads here and they are like the, 
I guess, the standard we're going to compare the rest of these shoes by. But you can tell by the boxes that they're totally different. The fragments and the shattered backboard boxes are a lot bigger than the, than the breads. All right, so if you look at the quality at the 27s, the quality control is a little bit off. Um, they don't look exactly the same. And if you flip over the boxes on the other side, uh, we've noticed that these lettering here, this is the standard right here. The lettering is bolder and these are not as bold here. Um, I don't actually see the other one. Oh, okay, it's all the way in down here. So they're all kind of like the similar um, this is the actual one I bought from GOAT. So the box is a little bit different. And also, I want you guys to look at the thickness of the covers. Let's take off the covers and put them side by side. Look at the height of the, of the covers. They're like different, different heights. You see that? So the quality for control of this is a little bit off here. Uh, so they need to fix that as well. So this is actually the red quality and this is, everyone knows, is plush. And we always try to compare it with the shattered backboards here. And you can tell that you can kind of see that they kind of emulated the shattered, uh, what do you call that? The the tumbled leather look, but it's not as soft as as this here. You can see kind of the leather cracking here. This leather here is very cheaply made. And then if you look at the fragments, this leather here is very cheap. You can kind of see that um, the stitching as well is not as as good as the the breads here. Um, look at how clean it is right here we got this spot here that's not too cleaned up um, and then most importantly everyone wants to know this part right here is supposed to be the most plush part of the shattered backboards this is a little bit stiff here so they got the look down but the quality is a little bit not as good next thing we got to talk about is the back end and you can see that there are a little bit different heights here the fragments are a little bit lower than the rest of these and um, I want to also point out that the plushness of the collar up on the top the breads are very plush and soft compared to fragments fragments are okay but the shattered backboards are very hard they're very hard and unforgiving on the ankles here so that's a problem with the leather here it's a little bit harder than the rest so I think those are the main main flaws that I see in this shoe here in these two pairs um, but I think other than that they're pretty good they're pretty good all right guys so this is my review of the Jordan ones that these two are actually all of these are my grails but um, they were a little bit more affordable and again, please check out yeseasy.club um, And I did talk to the owner CEO Jordan and he did give me these at a wholesale price um, So please check out yeseasyclub.com and DM me in the message boxes below if you want to get Jordan's information So that we can uh, maybe get you guys a pair as well um, Other than that, I think that this wraps it up and um, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and um, I'll see you guys next time please input the promo code that I have down below to get yourself 10% off your next purchase please enjoy this on foot footage of me wearing uh, these two pairs of shoes and let me know what you guys think see you guys in the next video I'm out